Let's go for a ride with 10 trivia questions on Universal Studios Florida. Let's get it. What up, what up, and welcome to another episode of the show. Today's episode is a special dedication from Sarah Van Ruten to her boyfriend, Jake Reed. Jake, Sarah is very proud of you for how you're doing in optometry school, so she wanted to dedicate an episode themed on your guys' favorite vacation spot, Universal Studios Florida. So these questions have to do with only Universal Studios Florida specifically, not any of its sister parks, so keep that in mind while we play and let's get going. Question number one, Diagon Alley is an area of Universal Studios Florida dedicated to what iconic book and film series? Diagon Alley is an area of Universal Studios Florida dedicated to what iconic book and film series? The second question today is, what well-known annual event does Universal Studios Florida operate during the fall season? What well-known annual event does Universal Studios Florida operate during the fall season? Question 3. Unique pretzels, hot dogs, and more are available at an Universal Studios Florida food stand called Swamp Snacks, which gets its theming from what popular DreamWorks franchise? Unique pretzels, hot dogs, and more are available at a Universal Studios Florida food stand called Swamp Snacks, which gets its theming from what popular DreamWorks franchise? Number four, what television network had a production studio at Universal Studios Florida where shows like Clarissa Explains It All, Legends of the Hidden Temple, and Double Dare were filmed? What television network had a production studio at Universal Studios Florida where shows like Clarissa Explains It All, Legends of the Hidden Temple, and Double Dare were filmed? Question number five is a multiple choice question. What year did Universal Studios Florida open? Your options are 1964, 1985, or 1990. What year did Universal Studios Florida open? 1964, 1985, or 1990? Number six, which of the following characters would you not be able to take a picture with at Universal Studios Florida? Doc Brown, Gru, Sonic the Hedgehog, or Dora the Explorer? Which of the following characters would you not be able to take a picture with at Universal Studios Florida? Doc Brown, Gru, Sonic the Hedgehog, or Dora the Explorer? Question number seven, what motion simulator dark ride based on The Tonight Show opened at Universal Studios Florida in 2017? What motion simulator dark ride based on The Tonight Show opened at Universal Studios Florida in 2017? Number eight, guests can choose the song they listen to aboard what steel roller coaster at Universal Studios Florida? Guests can choose the song they listen to aboard what steel roller coaster at Universal Studios Florida? Question number nine, what is the only remaining ride in Universal Studios Florida that debuted with the park's grand opening? What is the only remaining ride in Universal Studios Florida that debuted with the park's grand opening?
And the final question today, number 10, what are the two interactive shooting dark rides at Universal Studios, Florida? What are the two interactive shooting dark rides at Universal Studios, Florida? That's all of our questions for today. We'll be right back to see how well you knew this theme park. It took a lifetime to find the person you want to marry. Finding the perfect engagement ring is a lot easier. At BlueNile.com, you can find or design the ring you've always dreamed of with help from Blue Nile's jewelry experts who are on hand 24-7 to answer questions and the ease and convenience of shopping online. For a limited time, get $50 off your purchase of $500 or more with code POD at BlueNile.com. That's $50 off with code POD at BlueNile.com. Getting into our answers on Universal Studios Florida, our first question was, number one, Diagon Alley is an area of Universal Studios Florida dedicated to what iconic book and film series? That iconic series is a magical one. It is Harry Potter. Harry Potter. Question number two. What well-known annual event does Universal Studios Florida operate during the fall season? This spooky event is going on right now at that park. It is Halloween Horror Nights. Halloween Horror Nights. Number three, unique pretzels, hot dogs, and more are available at a Universal Studios Florida food stand called Swamp Snacks, which gets its theming from what popular DreamWorks franchise? That DreamWorks animation franchise is Shrek. Shrek. Question number four, what television network had a production studio at Universal Studios Florida where shows like Larissa Explains It All, Legends of the Hidden Temple, and Double Dare were filmed? Man, those are some of the shows I loved growing up as a kid in the 90s on the television network, Nickelodeon. Nickelodeon. Number five was our multiple choice question. What year did Universal Studios Florida open? 1964, 1985, or 1990? Universal Studios Hollywood opened in 1964 and 1985 is just a little bit too early for Florida. So the correct answer here is 1990. 1990. Question number six, which of the following characters would you not be able to take a picture with at Universal Studios Florida, Doc Brown, Gru, Sonic the Hedgehog, or Dora the Explorer? The character here that you would not be able to take a picture with at this theme park would be Sonic the Hedgehog. Sonic the Hedgehog. Number seven, what motion simulator dark ride based on The Tonight Show opened at Universal Studios Florida in 2017? I remember when this ride was announced, some people online weren't too excited for it, but hey, it's a pretty fun ride. It is called Race Through New York, starring Jimmy Fallon. Race Through New York, starring Jimmy Fallon. Question number eight. Guests can choose the song they listen to aboard what steel roller coaster at Universal Studios Florida? This fun and very fast ride is Hollywood Rip Ride Rocket. With its vertical lift, Hollywood Rip Ride Rocket. Number nine, what is the only remaining ride in Universal Studios Florida that debuted with the park's grand opening? That classic ride is E.T. Adventure. Based on Steven Spielberg's E.T., E.T. Adventure. And question number 10. What are the two interactive shooting dark rides at Universal Studios Florida? I am a big fan of shooting dark rides at theme parks. The two at Universal Studios Florida would be Men in Black, Alien Attack, and Illuminations Villain Con Minion Blast. Men in Black, Alien Attack, and Illuminations Villain Con Minion Blast that opened recently in 2023. 
Once again, I want to give a shout out to Jake Reed. Thank you for listening to the show. Good luck in optometry school. And thank you to your girlfriend, Sarah Van Ruten, for reaching out and supporting the show. All right, until next time, let's remember to be kind to each other. Peace. Bingo. All right, Phil, we're, we're recording now, so it's live. Go ahead. Pick on me the way that you want to. Did I say that? <laughs> I wouldn't yeah. say that to my son. Man, I mean, come on, man. Just go. This isn't CBS. All right, be quiet for a few seconds. Why would people want to listen to the Sims Complete Podcast? Well, a couple things. One, if you like to see sons pick on their father, this might be the place. If you want to see a place where the father just kicks the ass <laughs> out of his son, this would be the place. How, what do you like about it, Matt? Ditto. Father-son dynamic duo talking about the game of football that we love and share and appreciate together. And, you know, hey, it's an extension of what we did, right? Growing up, I, I was able to watch my father play football, then obviously watch him as a broadcaster. And then he taught me the game of football and share the wisdom that he learned throughout his playing career. And, wow. uh, you know, hey, sometimes we're full of it and sometimes we we actually know a thing or two. Well, we do do a lot of research. At least I do. I, you, you're a little spotty, but, you know, you're, you hang in there. <laughs> yeah. It's fun. I love doing this and it's been awesome. Sims Complete. Check us out wherever your podcasts are available on the Believe Network. Appreciate it. See ya.